Hello my friends and uh, welcome to the metal shop. Today we are doing the, well, hopefully will be the final assembly of the Fast Eddie Clark Ace of Spades Tribute Stratocaster. So we're up to this point, Evo you've seen all this where I put the pick art on and did some assembly. I got the uh, Stratocaster logo applied and clear coated. And I've got a couple of videos, short, well, a couple of shorts that you should have seen. Hopefully, I'll put them at the beginning of this video. Um, so, anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot this a couple of ways uh, just for my subscribers to know. <clears throat> I'm going to do the video of the assembly where I'll fast forward um, and put it to music and make a nice, short, little compact, you know, nice sanitized YouTube video. And it hopefully won't be terribly long, 20 minutes or less, I hope. I'm also going to use this opportunity to, in, I'm going to do this in full length, and I'm going to talk about a few subjects, and I will title it something completely different, and I'll use a different uh, image for a thumbnail, um, but I'm going to talk about YouTube's new monetization rules, I'm going to talk about uh, guitar trolls, YouTube trolls, and Instagram trolls and I'm gonna talk I'm just gonna talk 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 and it'll probably be you know a long a very long video a very long-winded video so be watching for both of those so to start with um, these holes need to be opened up just a hair for the tuners that I had and these are just some and they look kind of like Grover's they're Goto's um, that I had on hand everything I did here with this guitar was just stuff that I had on hand but you can see um, that this is a bunch of chipping these holes have already been widened I assume they had some type of uh, Fender Cluson type of tuners with a very very narrow hole these have already been widened by somebody previous to me there's lots of chip out I did not do that uh, I have a really good uh, drill bit that I got from Stuart McDonald that I'm going to use to hopefully open these up just a little bit without uh, without adding any more chipping. It shouldn't shouldn't be a big deal. Super super sharp bit. You just kind of lean it to the side a little bit and it'll open your hole right up. <laughs> Just give it that little bit. I go in from the face. Seems a little counterintuitive, but. If you go from the back side, you're, you're a lot more likely to get that chip out. Once you've opened the holes up though, then you can come in from the back side. Because honestly, that's where you need all the room anyway, is, is in the back where the, the tuner has to go in the seat. All right, put a lot of sawdust right on top of the guitar. Nice. Like I said, hack, hack job incorporated here. <laughs> not really, not really a big deal at all. Don't care. So anyway, I'm going to do the final assembly. Again, I'm going to talk through it in a separate video. So anyway, I'll give myself a cue here and we will uh, begin the final assembly. So there's my cue.
So I'm going to drill out the teensy little holes here in the back for the screws. Um, actually, a good tip is put tape, put some tape on your drill bit so you don't drill a hole in through the headstock, which honestly I've never done, but I have seen it done right in front of me. So the friend of mine, you know, let's call him a friend of mine. He's working on a guitar right in front of me. Drill right through his headstock. Yeah, he's had some kind of weird Clusani things on him, so. like that. Oh, found a hole and it lined up. A couple of these holes are lining up, sweet. Anyway, so another trick, and I'm sure you guys have seen this. But uh, put a little wax on your screws and see people don't have wax laying around. So where is it? Chapstick. Get the old chapstick out. I got this old Blistex. It's completely screwed up here on the tip just from... And this, of course, is like minty. Got like some menthol -y thing going on, so... Yeah, it smells good while you're doing it too. It's, I'm gonna, yeah, let's do this. Just to kind of give me a good surface here to work on. Do yourself a favor, put the wax on the screws. See that? And they, they'll drive right in even with this teeny tiny little screwdriver.
Music Nomad String Winder. What? This thing is fantastic. This has precision ball bearings in it, and it, it is just a joy to use instead of those crappy freebies that you guys get. I've been using this thing for years. This piece of junk that came free with something I bought, and it sucks. This thing, this Music Nomad, wow. I'm not saying it's the best thing in the world. Works good for me. I really like it. It's You change a lot of strings. This is just better. And it looks like well, we're definitely going to have to raise our action here a little bit. I'm going to give a pause here. All right, so we got it strung up. This thing needs some wicked setup. Action set way too low. Uh, it's got a wicked curve in this vintage trim. So I'm gonna have to attack these saddles. And a couple of these strings won't even ring out. So it needs, still needs quite a bit of work before it is playable. But I'm gonna leave you with, uh, oh my God, I can't believe he didn't tie those strings. <laughs> When he strung that on a vintage trim, I can't believe he didn't tie the knot on those tuning pegs. You did it wrong. Please let me know in the comments. <laughs> anyway, my, anyway, my friends, so the next video should be, hopefully, uh, a performance video with the uh, Fast Eddie Clark Ace of Spades tribute Stratocaster. Still needs quite a bit of work. I hope the rest of you hung in there through the full 40 minutes plus of my uh, my rant, my soapbox rant about shitty internet trolls and how uh, guys with zero talent have to uh, try and belittle other guitar players to make themselves feel like they have any value whatsoever. So, people that are doing that, right there. You got nothing nothing to add to YouTube at all, so right there. Put some content on your channel, then give guys some constructive criticism, otherwise you know where it is. You know right where it's at. Again, so in closing, no absolutes. Whatever works for you. Gibson, Fender, Elixirs, Theodario, Guitar Polish, Spit, whatever. Whatever works for you. You know, just because you own a guitar doesn't qualify you to criticize someone else. Just because you've been playing for 30 years doesn't give you the right to they criticize someone else you're a better guitar player than they are maybe you are maybe you aren't who knows anyway thanks for watching and stay tuned well uh i will do a performance video of this up for your criticism <laughs> very soon i'm gonna play uh i'm gonna play ace of spades i'm teaching myself the ace of spades not a very complicated song i know you can nail me on that oh, that song's easy i don't know it never learned how to play it i'm gonna teach myself how to play it and that's gonna be the first song I'm going to play on this guitar. It'll be a performance video. So, as always, my friends, thank you for watching. Please uh, consider subscribing. If you're new to the channel, give me a thumbs up. If you're so inclined, give me a thumbs down. If you didn't like the video, but please uh, tell me why. Please be constructive in your con criticism. And as always, take care, my friends. See ya.